Hey everyone, we're here to crash a party. I need to lock the door behind you. And Patrols in this episode, I'm hoping to show you guys some dialogue that I'm willing to bet most of you have not seen before. So, let's get this started. I'm wearing fire resist boots, and I'm going to drink the shock potion, fortify health. Did you see those robes? All right. I'm going to grab your elven armors because I want to take it to enchant later. As for you, I'm putting these on. Because the deal with this quest, if you are a high elf, then you can wear these hooded Thalmor robes, slow walk through the outside courtyard, and you will actually not draw aggro from anyone. The Thalmor in there uh, will think that you are one of them. Now, uh, as soon as you enter Elenwyn's room, then... Uh, that doesn't work anymore because like even if you are a guard, you're not supposed to be there. So I'm going to hotkey the savior's hide so I can put that on as soon as uh, we cross that door. Maybe I should have recasted my buffs before doing this. Ah, they should last. I have at least like two minutes on them, I think. And so you just talk to this guy over here. Why aren't you at your post, just this year? Why didn't you say so? Take over my post. Make sure nobody enters the solar. You pass a speech check, and he's supposed to walk out of the way. Yeah. There you go. So, that is a nice little Easter egg. Let's you skip. All right, we're in not touching the lingering poisons. Oh, wow, fearless destruction. That's lucky. Um, I mean, not for me. I'm not using destruction, but in general, that's lucky. Uh, yeah, what was I saying? It's a nice little Easter egg that lets you skip the pretty nasty courtyard fight. And the last fountain. Oh shoot, I forgot about this bug. Take your stuff. Um, yeah, I don't know what, why this happens in La La Land. Or I don't even know if it's La Land, because I've seen other people go through this quest and it's fine. Maybe it's just my install, I messed something up. But uh, all the Thalmor in this room are like invisible foxes. one more that I forgot to loot. Hey, watch it. In any case, that's the Thalmor Embassy. 
Wait, I have a fire sword. No, I don't. My fire sword is with Delphine. That's okay. Spell, A. And in the back of the Thalmor Embassy escape, there is a glass sword here. Now, this is technically accessible at level 1. Uh, and I think because of that, it's getting removed in the next F Tweaks update. But I think it's fair that once you pass through the Thalmor Embassy, then I can come and grab that sword. Alright guys, we're back in the Rift, and the rest of this episode is going to be fairly chill. Going to be doing some pretty easy things as far as our character's level is concerned. You see, uh, we are starting to reach that point in the game where this character wants to collect swords. Uh, the way that sword builds work is... You have like 10 different swords that are all effective against different types of enemies and you just got to collect the ones that you got to use the right ones for the right enemy. And the problem with that is carry weight. So we're going to go and grab ourselves a horse, specifically Frost, because again, this character needs lots and lots of gold. We're not going to pay 6,000 gold for a horse when we can get one for free. What do we got here? Didn't mean to hit Frost. Alright, hand over your valuables. But I will get. Don't you walk away from me. You know, just because we're strong doesn't mean we should be stupid. So, Splinter doesn't work because at uh, separating enemies because they can just walk over it anyway. Good to know. That works though. Born. There you go. Now we just steal the horse and hope that we don't run into any stupid random encounters.
You're okay. You're the scavenger. That's fine. And I think I heard a wolf. Two wolves. Should be far enough away that I can talk to Louis. Ha, you've done it. Your play. Fine. You win. Take the horse and leave. Nice. Get a thousand gold out of it too. Okay, now let's go save Esbern. Again, that should be a pretty quick and easy fight. Speech is at 50. Is that a level up? Nice. What do I want to level? Or a perk? I think more MR is the move. So the thing about the Altmer weaknesses is that you get around it by stacking straight MR. Because, I mean, the fact that you start at minus 25 means you need a lot more elemental resist enchants to, like, reach a... Well, enchants or potions to reach a good state. But your MR starts at zero, and so if you just stack a bunch of... Uh, stack as much of that as you can, then... Oh shoot, I don't have my buffs up. Huh? Fuck. Uh, okay, I didn't mean to cheese this with the Thieves Guild. I hope they don't get involved. Uh, I just not paying attention. Okay, looks like the Thalmor are not coming through there, which is good. Okay, let's try again. Alright, wizard is down, and that's really the only one I cared about. The odds are pretty non-threatening. Ah, your stuff's not tempered. There we are. 
Come in, come in. Make yourself. So, I thought she'd have realized. Haven't you figured? All the drag? No. Ah, I tried to tell. Like, oh, it seems that the gods have. What? Then, we must go. But give me just a moment. I must gather. I need. No. No. All right. Goal is just to ambush the Thalmor as soon as they spawn in. One moment. I know time is mustn't leave secrets for the Thalmor. One more. Well, I guess that's good enough. Let's be off. Who's who? All right, there we go. All right, guys. I hope you like the reach because we're gonna be spending a good chunk of the next few episodes here. Starting with, of course, the Karth Spire. Let's see what kind of dragon we get. What are you? Fireball. Okay. Let me make sure I have... Okay, that's good. Scimitar of Ice. Alright, where's the dragon? And we unlock Frost Breath. So, hoping that this will make things go a little bit faster. That hurt. Oh, I'm out of Magicka. That's what's going on. Uh, also, my surpassing didn't hotkey. God, I'm so not prepared for this fight. So, kind of a shame we did have to burn a surpassing there. Uh, and that was my fault. But over here, at least, he'll be on the ground. Esbern, this boy's a fire dragon. You're not going to be doing too much.
Man, Ward 3 is so expensive. Okay. At least the Force Warren are helping now. Honestly, I want to let the Force Warren do as much damage as they can. Because the dragons are the. are what's slow here. I can kill the Force Warren very quickly. Oh shit, there goes mage armor. I don't know if that reached. Do not want to fight him on the hill, actually. We know all about elevation and hitboxes. The Force weren't also shooting at me? They are. He is grounded. Do not like him grounded on the hill, though. You want to come down?
No. I hate how these embers on the ground will also activate the fire effect that, like, fucking blinds you. So annoying. Alright, mage armor is about to go. This is such a sloppy fight. Whatever, he's dead. Now it's just the Forsworn, and then I get Dragonbane, and we don't have to worry about this shit anymore. So, what buffs do I need? TM? and blur. Esbrin's dying to a mud crab. Yeah, so I've gone without blur for all this time, but now that we're fighting uh, Forsworn and eventually Falmer, I do want that extra protection. Oh, there's a, there is a hag raven around here. Somewhere. Unless she's dead, because I don't hear spells getting flung at me. Alright. What is going on? Oh my gosh. Fuck. <laughs> I still have my savior's hide on that hotkey. Okay. What is even going on? I need my shout cooldown. That is not the shout I meant to do. You summon is it like a skeever or something? Spirit skeever, yeah. First you, then all of the reach. Wait, I have range spells. What am I even doing? Oh, the Hagraven's down there. Oh, 
All right. That is everyone on the outside. It's a boss chest over here. With a single measly insight in it. Let's make sure Delphine is at full health before we go into this next area. Or like go into the interior. Okay, let's do this. Let's keep Our buff's going. doing, that's fine. Let's get the, the right shout that I want equipped. Delphine. I'm gonna need you to tank this guy too. No, don't. Why are you looking at me? How's this sword compared to... Oh, never mind. It's weak. Okay. That is Skyhaven Temple. I think I'm going to stop here for now. Not just the episode, but like playing, because I'm clearly not focused, and that's not where you want to be in late game Dead is Dead. It's way too easy for anything to just one-shot you. So, hope you all enjoyed this episode, and I will see you in the next one.